and the back. Nothing serious, just figured to make a distinction between building the minifigs and the little sets themselves. Although also, big detail just on making the minifigs, I forgot to get out Ride's camera. And really, I'm just going to pour out the pieces now. <laughs> They're kind of mixed up, so might as well. <laughs> and also Jemson's helmet. There's the visor. Yep. And Mae Jemison has her helmet. <laughs> it has kind of a loose grip. <laughs> Mix your little front heavy. And now for the camera. Goodness. <laughs> Organize these more sensibly, you're probably asking. Because I am just being weird like that. Where is that camera? Sensibly. Now onto the sets. First up is Margaret Hamilton's. So I guess we'll set these figs off to the side. Sorry again, to me. Again, sorry, this will probably be pretty.
pretty dry when it comes to banter, whatever you want to consider it. At least comment on some of my experience with Lego. As far as I know, I didn't have a lot of Lego when I was little. I remember at least having some like Duplos when I was very young. I don't really remember any other specific sets or anything that I had. Got the Sears Tower architecture set a few years back before it was reissued under the new Willis Tower name. And I got into getting some Star Wars Micro Fighters and Marvel and DC sets. Also the Lego Movie Double Decker Couch. Because come on, Double Decker Couch, people. And yes, I have wondered about the Lego Ideas Saturn V. Not sure where I would put it, but I am interested in getting it. <laughs> if I do assemble it in a video, it might be time-lapse. It's going to probably take a number of hours. But this, while it probably will take a while, because I am slow. At least won't speed through in just like a few seconds. Of playback. Here's the gray, gray square. Also, if by chance this is somehow among the first videos you've seen, noticed on the subject of Lego ideas, and are unsure of what that means, it's based on fan submitted ideas. They provide info on the build, the minifigs, the accessories, the like play or cultural significance. If it gets enough votes, you can get approval move on to a professional design process and sometime after that hit stores
That's an interesting distinction. That's an interesting replacement. I think I've when there's bits of empty space left in there, but of course it doesn't affect the layout or structure or anything in a bad way. Okay, set that aside for a moment. for a second. Also, if you follow the history of this set at all, I have remembered that mathematician Katherine Johnson was one of the minifigs included, and her diorama, I think, was about either Mercury or Apollo, like launch or navigation information. Fortunately, under some kind of circumstances, they couldn't get the rights to her likeness for this set. Unfortunate. Maybe in, I don't know, some future set, maybe they'll include her. Maybe the next time around. But when it comes to, like, wider cultural exposure, at least she was one of the major players in the book and movie adaptation, Hidden Figures. Speaking of which, I still gotta at least see that movie. Heard great things.
you've got a favorite Lego set or something, feel free to let me know in the comments. Any Lego Ideas sets that you like that are out, or ones that you're hoping get approval sometime in the near future? They're currently on the website. Not sure what those abbreviations are, but obviously related to navigation for the Apollo missions. At least one of them. Darn it, sorry. Sorry, mate. <laughs> Must be that helmet. Attach this to this. Oh, nope. Make it nice and clean. Yeah, that's good. to the stack. Kind of stack them haphazardly. Was hoping to try to do it as the instructions say, but whatever. Guess I'll stack it in a way that makes it look like they could still stably be atop each other. Yeah, all right. <laughs> Right 
really have seen the original photo this is based on, but I forget what this brown thing that I'm now making is. It's in the corner. So Margaret here. Find her nameplate. And there's her display. Very nice. Showing off the huge stack of paper on, I think it's Apollo navigation software. As original photo shows, the stack's basically as tall as she is. So basically just picture several phone books worth. Okay, take another short break, and then on to the next one, which is the space shuttle one for Ryan and Jameson. <laughs> 